Hi, welcome back to Edible Whole Foods. Dairy farmers in America, they're very, very important to us, and, and some dairy farmers do it a little bit differently and a little bit better than others. And I am very proud and honored to have with me Bob Nutter, Maple View Dairy Farms. The farm's been in your family for a while, I take it. We moved to North Carolina in 1963 and bought the farm where we are now in Hillsboro, North Carolina. I had five children, they all left the farm, and I was there by myself operating it. And I thought, well, this, why, do, why do this? So I took a partner in with him and sold him a half interest of the cows and equipment. And uh, the price of milk just got to where he couldn't make his payments. So we had a choice. We could sell out or, or go a different way. And so uh, we, we decided to, to bottle our own milk. And, and uh, I talked to my son, which he was in construction then, and, and asked him if would he want to come back to the farm and, and bottle milk, and he said yes. And so he and my daughter both came back to the farm and, and built the bottling process. So you got them back. You made got, it a family uh, farm again. That's right. Well, I've always heard that people just can't get too far away from the farm. It's always in their blood, always in their roots. Um, we're going to talk about your ice cream a little bit. Uh, Whole Foods is having a huge ice cream spectacular this week, and one of the things that they're going to be featuring is, is Maple View Dairy Farm ice cream, which I happen to like because you do really cool flavors like ginger ice cream, which I love, <laughs> which is you need to make more of. By oh, the way. <laughs> and but of course you can make sundaes. But we we've made some ice cream sandwiches, and this is something that you can do with your kids. It's a lot of fun. You kind of go ahead and let them get their hands all gooey, gooey. Um, I got snickerdoodles. Now we've got strawberry, butter pecan, orange cream, chocolate chip, banana, pistachio. What do you think would be best with a snickerdoodle cookie? Well, probably vanilla. Well, I didn't bring vanilla. <laughs> you weren't supposed to say vanilla. I'm going with orange cream. All right, that sounds good. Get your kids in, let this stuff soften just a little bit. It's really simple, just a little bit of spoon. If it's hard and you kind of want to make it move around on you, use your hands because it will melt ice cream pretty quick. Take this, wrap it in aluminum foil and stick it in your freezer for a little while and let it get good and hard. All right, now I got a really tough question. These are vegan, ugh, vegan oatmeal raisin cookies. Uh-huh. Uh, how are we gonna dress that one up? Oh, uh, let's use some orange cream on that one. Orange cream, okay. Now what would you do with chocolate chip before I tell you what I've done over there before you got here? Uh, that one was an easy one for me. Is that right? Banana. Banana? Bananas and chocolate. Oh, well, you're right about that. I mean, I think that's one of the really cool flavors together. So I'm gonna take a little banana here and throw that on chocolate chips. Now, folks, you can do a lot of stuff here. You could take some toppings. You could brush the cookies first with chocolate. Mm -hmm. You could put some caramel on there. You could take this, put some bananas down, put the banana ice cream in there. You can gussy it up just as much as you want to or as little as you want to. But it's a great way to kill an hour in the kitchen with your kids. They're looking for something to do, and you're going to be the biggest hero there is. Let's have a bite. Sure. Why you do that? I'm gonna have a bite. <laughs> All right. Uh huh. Mm hmm. What do you think? Good. Good. Heard good. from the man himself. Really good. Look for local products. Look for local ice cream. Local milks. They will always be better. And you're supporting the community. You're putting money back in the community, and you're allowing families to keep their farms and move on. We need them. Care for them. Thank you, sir, for being here. Thank you for what you do. Well, thank you very much. And I appreciate you taking the time. Thank you. All right, now we're going to have an ice cream party. <laughs> Come back to see us next week on Edible Whole Foods.